Hi, this is Dr. Tina van Leuven from Inner Delight, and I'm joined here today by Dr. Stephen Marcus. And we have joined together to present the most extraordinary journey called Coming Home to Your Heart, which is starting on Monday, July 26th. What brought this journey about was us connecting through social media and actually eventually meeting in person and knowing that the time that we had spent together connecting on Skype and through webinars and other video technology uh, really created a deep connection and that when we met in person it really it was just like walking out of the video screen and into each other's lives so these amazing connections are being built with the magic of social media and technology and so this journey was inspired by us both really living our purpose, living that which brings us the greatest joy. And that, for me, is about helping people to reconnect with their joyfulness, their essence, and allowing those fears and obstacles that may get in the way and hold you back, keep you living small, to be cleared up and released so that you may embrace that wisdom and those gifts and talents and that infinite possibility um, that love that is in your heart to guide you rather than be guided by fear. And so, Stephen, what does coming home to your heart mean to you? Well, for me, at first, it seems to be about making choices, but ultimately it actually comes down to making that choice that isn't a choice. Because uh, when you start to look at it, when you clear away all those fears and doubts, you realize there's, there's one thing that you're being called to do. It's the one thing that has the most aliveness and the most joy in it for you. And it's simply about choosing that and putting, putting my energy behind that. And so for me, last year when I really started connecting and getting involved with social media and bringing a whole new spiritual context to it, uh, that's, that's when I realized this is, this is what I'm here for. This is, this is my purpose on this planet. As I look back through my life, I see, see clear pointers all along of my involvement with technology, involvement with spirituality, sometimes one path, sometimes the other. And then there's a point where they really come together. And as, as you were mentioning, uh, the experience, which isn't just, I know it's not just the two of us, because we've heard from many other people in the, in the uh, collaboration we've been working in, where people have come to meet one another and have discovered that as they open, as they open their hearts to one another, there's a tremendous feeling of support and connection. And when they actually get to meet, as you said, it's like somebody walks out of the computer screen and there's no there's really no separation between what people call real life and, quotes virtual life. And the two flow into one another. And, uh, and that's really been amazing. So that's, that's what we see, see many of you getting out of, the, uh, out of the journey that we're going to be offering over the next two months. It's going to be an opportunity to, to clear the obstacles out of, out of your way so that you can make that choice, which isn't a choice in your life. And at the same time that you can meet from, from your home, uh, without leaving your home, you can meet people from all over the planet, uh, open your hearts, find support and connection in, as, you, as you take these steps with one another. So we invite you to come and join us. Yeah, and also we have a beautiful community on Facebook where we're able to interact with one another. And oftentimes, you know, the one thing that I find when I work with clients to support them in their journey to their heart is that it's somebody believing in you, somebody holding the vision for you or having a safe space where you can share your dreams that you you may have given up on, you may not even remember what they are anymore. And that as you have that support in place, you start finding that, as Stephen was saying, you look back at your life and you go, this is what has been pointing to all along. How didn't mm -hmm. I see it? So, that, you know, when you're living from your heart, they say the longest journey is from your head to your heart, 20 centimeters or whatever it is, 25 centimeters. And that... You know, that, that I really feel that that is where we're being guided to, to let our heart be where we live from and to allow our minds to be in service of our hearts. And that when we bridge those two, bring those two together, then amazing miracles happen. So we are really excited to be sharing this journey with you. And I know that if you're watching this and you're being called to come home to your heart, then this may just be the next step for you. So come and join us. The information to sign up is at www.onearth.net.